to us live from her from from uh, La Bac Deca. Yeah, um, as she spent some time in Porta Backyarda, and then she went to Bac Deca, and then later she'll go into uh, Los Kitchen, and then after that maybe Los Living Room. Yeah, that's what we're doing now these days on a holiday weekend. Hello, everybody. Welcome back in. It's In the Kitchen with David. I'm David Venable. On this unofficial start of summer weekend, we are thrilled you're with us, and we're going to talk now about the house-to-home countertop suction slicer and grater with three barrels. If you're watching this show, you probably love to cook. What you don't love to do in all likelihood is all the prep, and I think most of us feel that way. We'd rather get into the more creative and fun part of the cooking and spend less time with the tedious prep. So what if we had a device that would suction cup to your countertop, and with a simple turn of a crank, you'd be able to slice, do coarse grating, and then fine grating. All of that happens with this item. It is K47617. We've got some great colors for you, so let me go through those colors, making sure I call them all the right things. This is red, and I'm gonna tell you right now, that's gonna be super popular. Then from here, we're gonna go to our blue. Then we get into gray. Don't forget black. And finally, we have it for you in the green. Rick Roman is our guest with this item. He put together a little tape from home, so let's take a look and a listen on how to work with this in your own kitchen, and then we'll come back and do some live demos and welcome him in by phone. It's great to be here, and thanks for joining me in my kitchen. This barrel grater is gonna make such easy work of all your prep in the kitchen, from shredding your favorite cheeses to slicing and grinding. It does it all, and it does it without any electricity, and best of all, it suction cups to any smooth countertop like I have here with my granite. Now, it comes with three barrels, a coarse grater, a slicer, and a fine grater. I'm gonna use the fine grater to do some cheddar cheese because we're making some tacos later. But what I love about it is how easy it is to just simply put the cheese or ingredient into the chute, and then all you do is simply turn the handle, and in a matter of seconds, you get beautiful, perfectly shredded cheese, and just that easy. This could be mozzarella, this could be Parmesan, this could be Gouda, your favorite cheese, and there's no preservatives, there's no getting your hand near the blades, and when the cheese starts to get a little small, I can use our safety pusher, which has a little arrow to indicate which way to push it. Then I can get every last bit and every last drop of whatever I'm shredding, slicing, or grating. And just that fast, we did an entire block of cheddar cheese. And here's the great thing. It's perfectly grated, okay? Every piece is nice and fluffy. So if I'm making tacos, quesadillas, you name it. Now the great thing about this is everything is dishwasher safe and it's easy to take apart. On the back handle, there's a little screw. You simply unscrew the handle and that releases the handle. That comes off, that can go in the dishwasher. The barrel itself simply pops out like that. This can go in the dishwasher. And then the chute itself can slide off and go in the dishwasher. So not only is cleanup easy, it also makes easy work of all your prep. I absolutely love this, whether I'm shredding vegetables, slicing cucumbers, grinding graham crackers for a great cheesecake. This is gonna be your go-to tool in the kitchen. And I hope you love it as much as I do. All right, let's welcome in our buddy Rick Roman live on the phone. Rick, how are you, pal? Hey, David, happy Memorial Day. How are you? We're doing well, and I hope you and your family are also well. Yes, thank you very much. Excellent. So we're talking about taking the work out of prep work. We just saw your great demonstration there. I've got some here on set. And what's really great about this item is that there are no motors, no batteries to buy, just a little old-fashioned elbow grease, right? So if I want yeah, to be able what? to do these carrots, okay. check this out. Don't yeah, blink. You might David. miss it. Yep. And what's great about it is it's, it's just a simple hand crank. I love the fact that you can just pull this out of the drawer quickly, David, and you don't have to plug any big appliances in. So if you're doing soups, salads, you're shredding cheese, we've shredded so much cheese in the last few months, you know, making quesadillas, you name it. But it works so easy and fast, and the suction cup is so strong when you get it on a smooth countertop, David. It does not budge. And I'm doing some celery now. Maybe we're making a soup. Maybe we're making some mirepoix here. But look at all of the great even shredding that goes on, whether it's celery, zucchini, carrots. But why don't we get over into our grating a little bit here? Because one thing that I love to do is make fresh hash browns. And oh, that's... in order to do that, you need to be able to shred those hash browns, right? So check this yeah, out. Yeah, you know what I love? Yeah, I love you just wash the potato. I leave the skin on because uh, I love that little texture. And you can just push it right through. And you can make hash browns. You could actually make little potato pancakes with that. Uh, fry them up in the pan with some cheddar cheese and some bacon. Oh, unbelievable. And then when you get down a little lower, get some nice pressure on there with your put. Oh, hello. How you doing, volume? Hey. Look at that. Hey, 
And David, on the pusher, when you sh- when you use the pusher, it's really important. There's a little arrow that actually says uh, pointing forward. You want to make sure that's the direction it's facing. Otherwise, the pusher will hit the barrel. So you just want to make sure it's facing the right way. Yeah, mine has an arrow pointing forward, and it says front and back on it. Correct. Yep, yep. And you know what's great? If you're a baker, David, I tell you what, ram crackers, nuts, little candies. You can grind and grate all these different things for your baking. So even if you're not shredding cheese, it has so many other uses. I mean, check this out. If you're making your own pizza, if you're topping your pasta with a little fresh cheese, or maybe some and by, pasta and by with your cheese. By the way, David, pre-shredded cheese, if you look at the packages of pre-shredded cheese, most of them have either cellulose powder or some kind of additive that actually keeps it separated. For me, I just want cheese in my cheese, so I love fresh shredding it with this thing. Exactly. And what you're also going to love about something like this is that you can make your own graham cracker crumbs to make your own graham cracker crust if you're doing more baking at home, and I think most of us are, right? Oh, absolutely. And you know what's also fun with the kids? If you want to put in candies, you could put in, uh, you know, candy peanuts and put it over your ice cream. You can crush peanuts, walnuts, almonds, you name it. And you can see just how quickly it just grates and grinds through all these different ingredients. Well, I can tell you now over a thousand of these are gone. Here's your green. I've got it in black. Here it is in gray. Don't miss out on the blue. And finally, I have it for you in the red. All of this for $26 and change. Put it on any card, and we've got three easy payments. Put it on your Q card, and I've got six today. Mr. Roman, always a pleasure to have you back with us, buddy. Thank you, David. Be well, and happy Memorial Day to everybody watching. You take good care of yourself and be well. Thank you. Bye-bye now. All right, we're moving right into another great